check it, check it. Mr. Mockty back row ministry in moving mode. Getting ready for this new move to New York, New Jersey area. A little bit tired. You can see I'm looking horrible right now. I'm gonna get it together. Though. I'm gonna get it together. Uh, peace out to Matt Talbot. Uh, much respect, much love. Uh, thank you for everything you guys did for me while I was here in Cleveland. Um, back row ministry moving to New York, New Jersey area. Um, real quick, I'm gonna talk about that corniness that was uh, supposed to be a fight that I didn't watch. I checked the results. I went either draw. I didn't see a reason for Floyd to win the fight. I don't think it does anything to help boxing. Some people might disagree with me. That's your opinion. My opinion is it hurts boxing because you got a, a fight like Alvarez and Triple G coming up, which is going to be a much more entertaining fight. Of course, they already know who's going to win the fight, but still it's going to be much more entertaining than the garbage that uh, you witness on Saturday, which wasn't nothing but a, a quick Vegas take. You know, you get a bunch of guppies who vet, bet for you know, a, a guy who they know can't go past five rounds. Hey, it's an MMA fighter. I mean, he's a five-round guy. And, you know, you put him in a situation where, as, you know, I guess a seasoned veteran like Floyd, he'll wear him down after a while. Total garbage. Closing on Floyd Mayweather's career. I'm going to say it like this. Floyd Wayne Mayweather, in my opinion, is one of the most wasted talents in boxing history. Floyd has never had a war. You think about the greats, Rocky Malciano. We talk about Joe Lewis. We talk about um, Sugar Ray Leonard. We talk about Muhammad Ali. We talk about even Larry Holmes. Um, the list goes on and on and on. Parnell Whitaker. These guys had that guy. They had that rival. They had that guy that, you know, time and time again, this guy would come back after him. You know, it, it was always a war. You know, Acosta Zeus, Isaiah Judas. They always had a war. Floyd Mayweather never had that. I'm sorry to say, ladies and gentlemen, if you go through his career, you don't see that guy. You don't see that rival. He could have had that with Pacquiao. He chose not to because Floyd's father and Floyd's camp has always been in protect Floyd mode since the one time Floyd almost got beat. And to me, that took away from the legacy of Floyd Mayweather. He didn't fight the Costa Zoos. He didn't fight Zab Judah in his prime. He didn't fight the Ricky Haddon's in their prime. He didn't fight Pacquiao when that fight was wide open when both of those guys were there in prime. I don't call him a great fighter. Smart fighter, yeah, because he fought at a time when everybody was washed up and he knew he could, could, can get some victories. But outside of that, I can't call him a great fighter. I can't, and I never will. Is he um, the man who should have got that 50 on a record? No, because he did nothing to prove it to me. I mean, I was never sold on Floyd. He's always was a boring fighter, dull, put you to sleep. And he pretty much did that his whole career. So if you're trying to say that this is a fighter in the class of the Ali's and Sugar Ray Leonard's and Rocky Marciano's and uh, Sugar Ray Robinson's, no, he's not. He didn't have a war. Where was his rival at? Where's his guy? Where's this guy that you could say, time and time again, these guys put it out there, he came out on top. He doesn't exist. So, I know a lot of people disagree with me, but I'm gonna say it, and like I've been saying it for a long period of time, Floyd Mayweather's wasted talent. He's a guy who they allowed to make a lot of money. He flaunts it well, but to me, he really has no legacy in boxing. He, does, he did absolutely nothing in boxing, and he beat nobody. He beat a bunch of old guys. People thought Ricky Haddon. He beat Ricky Haddon, a guy who he was well oversized in the match. So it was a lot of times when Floyd could have really put it out there and really could have had some good matches, and he chose not to. At the end of the day, Floyd, it was about the money. And I know my black folk, they been man, it's always about the money. He got paid. Yeah. But when is it going to be about legacy? When is it going to be about the sport? And with some of these guys, it's not about the sport. Floyd gets in the ring, man, it's just a job. Why the fuck you do it then, Floyd? Why the fuck you do it? And then you say it's just a job, and then you say you want to be in the same ranks as Ali. Come on, dude. It doesn't work for me. So Floyd Mayweather, pretty much his last fight, pretty much, uh, you know, summarized his whole career. Hot, buttered, garbage. Mr. Mocky, Back Road Ministry, Peace and Hair Grease, coming with some content the next time around. Peace.